everyone welcome back to another video on my channel today I just wanted to have a little quick um, pregnancy update so I am 26 weeks right now so yesterday we had the ultrasound which is actually the second one that we've been to the first one was our 20 week ultrasound and at that one they didn't get all of the pictures of the heart that they would have liked to so we had to come back a second time and everything looks good which is super relieving um we weren't really like too worried about it there she is again we weren't too worried about it just because the ultrasound tech last time kind of let us know that it's not a huge deal usually because sometimes babies just don't completely cooperate with the ultrasound and that is the main reason that they didn't get And that is the main reason that they didn't get all of the pictures of his heart. So we went back this time and I'll show you some of the pictures right now. So we went back and everything was good. We could see his face uh, really well this time. Last time he was turned kind of more so that we could only see like this part of his face so and he didn't turn at all last time he was very uh still and so this time he that the ultrasound tech actually said that he was being a wiggle worm <laughs> which is what i have been feeling for like a solid month now he's very 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 active but i think that he has my nose and you guys can decide for yourself um and let me know Here's my profile. But I think he has my nose and Alex's lips, but obviously it's just a guess. You can't really know for sure until you see him and until he's probably much older than he is now because he he's still gonna change a little. So at the ultrasound, they let us know that he weighs two pounds and one ounce, which is still a little bit big, but it's in a totally normal range. So he's more so on the larger side of the average range, I suppose, which um, Alex and I were both pretty big babies, so. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I'm fully expecting him to be like a solid 10 pound baby. So right around the 24 week mark is when I started having nerve pain in uh, my sciatic nerve which if you don't know uh, runs along kind of your uh, lower back through your bottom all the way kind of down your leg on your left side um, so I stood up and I didn't even like I didn't think I stood up too fast or anything I just stood up and um, I had a shooting pain going down my leg which was a little bit startling because at that point I really was having I mean I've had a really smooth second trimester I really haven't experienced much pain at all I've been very very fortunate in that and so it suddenly experiencing a nerve pain of course I'm like freaking out but um, it's just nerve pain I'm just gonna have it probably uh, uh, he's putting a lot of pressure on my tailbone it's all good though he's still only two pounds <laughs> um, speaking of which I have been having a lot of lower back pain uh, usually I don't know if you see that little foam roller right there and my so that's Alex's he had that a long time ago and it's been coming into great use because he's been like rolling my back out and it's really 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 helping when he does it but then about maybe an hour later it already hurts again but something really neat that happened this last week is I was just laying in bed because I can't sleep because I'm not sleeping very well I was just laying in bed and I was listening to some music on Spotify I was listening and singing along to a baby playlist that I created which is just um, different songs that I think would be fun to sing to him once he gets here so I was like okay I'm just gonna sing along to some of these songs and suddenly out of nowhere he just started I mean it was like he was doing the worm inside of me he was going crazy it was hilarious and really really 
cool at the same time. Um, it was just really sweet and I feel like we really bonded. So as far as cravings go, I haven't really had many uh, new cravings. My current cravings though are like to the tofu BLTs, tomatoes, and chipotle tacos. Those three things I feel like I could eat all day long, 24 seven. Like those are everything to me right now. I love those things. So I guess savory, salty things are what I'm craving so much. His kicks and punches and moves and squir general squirming inside of me is, um, it's becoming much more obvious what part is what. And it was actually really cool. Uh, he, at the, at the ultrasound, he had his like little fist up and he went, mm. <laughs> and I felt it at the same time as I was looking at it on the screen. And I was just kind of reconfirming to me that, yeah, that is a fist. I was right about that guess. And then when he turned during the ultrasound, his head moved and I could completely feel that it was like a really big pressure. And I knew that that meant that that was his head. And before now, I really haven't been able to identify what part is what on him. So it was really neat that my guesses were correct. Uh, so that just means that he's getting big enough to guess what is what, which is really cool. Next week I have my 28 week glucose test, um, which is where you go in and drink this little Kool-Aid kind of beverage, which is just basically pure sugar and flavor. <laughs> and you, so you go in and you drink that. They test your blood before and after to see how your body handles the sugar. So I'm a little bit nervous about that. I'm not gonna lie, uh, tests uh, gestational diabetes and diabetes does run in my family pretty heavily actually. Um, both my grandmas have had it or slash do have it. Uh, my mom had gestational diabetes when she was pregnant with me. So it's scary, I'm not gonna lie. I'm definitely going to feel a lot better once I get that phone call that tells me everything's okay. Um, I feel like I've been pretty healthy throughout my pregnancy, but lately I have definitely gotten a sweet tooth and Easter's coming up, so I know that that is literally really bad timing. I'm trying to take it in balance, and I'm trying to do things like drinking a smoothie when I want something sweet, so at least it's fruit. Um, so I think that's it for this update. That's really all I had to uh, inform you all on. So I will see you all later. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, turn on your notification bell, which is right next to the subscribe button at the bottom of this video. And that way you'll be notified whenever I upload a video. So, uh, yeah, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time.